Um, my name is Willie O'Connell. I'm the Managing Director for Comscope in Northern Europe, which is U UK, Ireland and the Nordics region. I think the, the smart building sector is very exciting. I think we're actually just reaching the point uh, where it's going to get particularly exciting. I think we've talked for quite a while about smart buildings, and I think certainly we have buildings that are smarter now than buildings were five years ago, but I think real smart buildings is just about to start. And that's been enabled by convergence, um, as we've seen the movement of all of the building's facilities onto the IP network. It opens up massive opportunities to do some really clever things with lots of data that's coming from the buildings to make them truly, truly smart. And in essence, make them truly efficient in terms of asset utilization and energy efficiency. Uh, this, this really only becomes possible because of the smart building. In reality, uh, if you want to be very efficient, you've got to measure. And that measurement is going to become possible simply because of the vast array of various sensors and detectors that will be around the building. And once we've got that data, if you can measure something, then you can start to improve on it. So as an example, for instance, if we measure the energy that's being consumed by a building and we make that visible to the people that are working within that building, they feel some ownership in terms of what it is they could do to drive down the energy efficiency or to drive down the energy demand, I should say, within, within that building. Uh, and that's only a very small example of, what, of, of the things that we can do. I think we're at the cusp of something great. I think in five years' time we will have some truly smart buildings that will do some truly clever things that will be truly very efficient in terms of asset utilization, that will be truly energy efficient uh, and will be much more carbon not carbon neutral, but certainly will we'll have a much reduced carbon footprint than buildings have today. Within Comscope, we, we, we currently spend about 100 million a year on research and development. And the vast majority of that now is being spent on the whole issue of smart buildings and smarter networks. Uh, in, again, fa trying to uh, come up with solutions that will solve what are the two critical problems for our customers, and that is uh, operational efficiency and energy efficiency. Um, so if you look to some of the things that we've been doing for the last 12 months, for instance, we've introduced a new lighting system, a LED lighting system, which is powered and controlled over data cabling. Uh, but the real value of that is, as a lighting system is that it comes with sensors associated with every light. So we can measure proximity, so we can tell if there are people there and turn the lights off if they're not. We can measure temperature or we can measure light level. So we can do late daylight harvesting. So we have a wealth of data coming back that we can use within the lighting system to have a more efficient lighting system. But more importantly, we've got a wealth of data coming back that we can help drive things like uh, meeting room booking systems, like micromanaging BMS systems so that the climate control is directly related to the occupancy level or the temperature within the room. So, uh, in addition to that, we've also gone out and we've introduced some new in-building wireless solutions which operate over the data cabling infrastructure. Uh, again, a critical piece of infrastructure for businesses as the BYOD or bring your own device uh, wave rolls over all of the office spaces uh, around the city. Uh, so, uh, our focus now is on bringing some intelligence to the passive layer and making the passive layer the foundation upon which all of these converged networks will operate, which will truly bring ar around the, the solutions which will be the smart building solution. We have a long-standing relationship with Redstone going back many, many years. Redstone is, is one of our premier partners in the UK and have been at the forefront of driving the intelligent building infrastructure and we've been there with them throughout that drive. I think they've introduced some very, very smart technologies that are integrated with technologies that we've brought. So I see Redstone as being to the forefront of this technology. I see them as being a very important partner of ours. I see them as being the company that can truly integrate some of our solutions with other solutions to come up with an overall solution for customers uh, to get them to this smart building space that we're trying to get to. I think Redstone are well positioned to do this and probably uniquely so.